Minecraft seeds are meant to generate new worlds. But what happens when that generation becomes corrupted? What kind of secrets actually lie deep within the code? Well, today, audience, we're going to find out. Starting with 404 null. Now, right away, I can't even lie to you guys. This one's a little sus. 404 in computer language does mean error. That's great. I I'm sure this is a very safe world. And oh, wait, I just noticed I put the seed for the name. Okay, whoops, my bad. There we go. But then for world name, I'm thinking... Oh my goodness, I'm so scared right now. <clears throat> Minecraft world one. Yeah, I'm not scared. Let's go ahead and put it to survival. We're gonna allow cheats off. That way we stay in survival and you know that there's no cheating. We actually need to fight off whatever we're going to find in here. And here we go. The seed is loading up. And this actually might be the craziest seed I've ever joined. And boom, we are in. Now, right away, nothing looks too out of the ordinary. It looks like we're in a taiga biome, which I would actually say is one of the more creepy biomes, but it, it's pretty normal. There's nothing really standing out to me in this seed, except what if I told you that there's something watching us right now out there and apparently it's stalking us as well it's following my every move even though i can't see it now i know this sounds really creepy but this is just according to the lore so if it's fake we should be all right even though i am gonna hike up on top of this boulder so it can't get me but let me ask you guys what do you think the first mob added into minecraft was this sounds random but it will all make sense and i know what you guys are thinking oh skidzy it's a creeper it's probably a cute little dog no it is so much worse than that let me explain okay so we are on the minecraft mobs wiki right now and this is human and this was the first mob ever added to minecraft in 2011 but as you can see soon after they were removed and it even says that their behavior they would attack other players and chase the player like a zombie now this is where it gets a little creepy humans were also named monsters and they are also a type of clone there's even people commenting that they mistook it for herobrine so the theory for this seed is that the entity itself isn't Steve, but actually, as you can see, a clone of the player. Now, I know what you're thinking. Skitty, it says in the forum post that they removed it. Well, according to the lore in this seed, they didn't actually remove it. They just made it invisible. So if you can glitch the game enough, you'll literally find your clone, which watches you and chases you around. So today, that's literally going to be my job, trying my hardest to figure out a way to get this guy to come out. And I can't even lie to you guys, even just talking about it, it's got me kind of creeped out right now. Okay, so first things first, before it turns night, we need to build a shelter. And ow, there is some stuff right here. We have a golden shovel and a helmet. Yeah. And just in case this thing freaking pops out, I'm gonna make a portal. I swear I thought I saw something through the portal, but no, I think I'm actually just seeing things, I hope. Yeah, I literally don't see anything at all. But if you guys saw something, rewind the video and check for me. Okay, let's go ahead and punch some wood. Whoa, wait, I swear those leaves just despawned really fast. That's definitely happened to me before on like scary seeds. That was definitely just an odd bug, I think. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with this seed. I'm literally mining a tree and it's just not doing anything. But then when I use my hand, it works perfectly. Okay, I've never seen that before. And boom, okay, we now have all the basic supplies. And something I just realized is I haven't seen one mob this entire time. Like, there's no fish in the water or any squids or anything. Okay, I guess I'll just have to rely on kelp. It's my only food source. All right, let's break that. There we go. Okay, we actually need to make shelter a lot faster. I did not realize that it's almost nighttime already. So I'm thinking that we could probably do something like a treehouse okay that was, that was a little weird I, I have a shovel i have a shovel oh gosh okay it's already turning sunset i swear i saw something that time i thought it was like when i looked through the water but 
I don't see anything now. Okay, okay. We just need to go. Okay, yeah, we gotta go. We gotta go. I don't wanna see what happens when it gets dark out. So we need to make a shelter quickly. And I'm thinking this tree actually might be the perfect spot. So let's go ahead and make some ladders. You guys already know, okay? I'm making high ground. So let's go ahead and just mine all this out. And then let's reinforce it with some spruce planks. And now let's add some fences. Okay, there we go. And now we need some microwaves, baby. Um, yum, 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 yum. Oh, okay. That's so much better. But I can't lie. This treehouse, it's uh, it's it's a little cramped. So I think we could actually add like an upstairs. Because listen, guys, there's definitely something out there. And we're going to need a sturdy base to defend against it. Okay, so this is actually turning out pretty good. I'm thinking that up here is going to be like the safe house. But then down here, what we built before, this is going to be like the observation deck. And this is perfect because I have a bird's eye view of the entire forest. So I could kind of just look out. And a little trick that I've been doing is just reloading the chunks. Because if you guys didn't know, that also reloads entities in the in the world. Okay, again, I thought I saw him in the corner of my eye. I actually feel like I'm going crazy, guys. I probably didn't see anything, but yeah, I'm actually creeped out again. Okay, so we need to just continue this base. Okay, so I went ahead and added a roof and some balconies. Let's just add some doors. And then we're definitely gonna need a trapdoor right there. And now that our base is fully complete, I think it's time that we actually face this thing. Okay, like I said, I, I have a shovel. Hello? Is anyone out there? Okay, no, no response. Okay, so I'm thinking the first thing that we need to check is this portal right here because I thought... Wait, why did I just damage okay that was super weird you guys saw that right i literally took damage and it wasn't from the magma block i was literally all the way over there okay i'm gonna try looking through this portal again because i thought that's where i first saw him and wait i also thought i saw him when i looked through the water oh my gosh guys i get it now and also when i'm reloading the chunks he's right in front of me i literally just He's right there! Run, run, run. Go, 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 go. Oh my gosh. Okay, guys. Guys, I have a plan. I have a plan. I just took damage again. Okay, I'm logging out. Okay, please save. Please save. It worked! Oh my gosh. Okay, it worked. We're in. So that entire time, guys, I was using the replay mod. And for you guys who don't know what that is, it pretty much just records your entire world and gives you, like, all the replay footage of it. So I could go anywhere and I can see everything. So if we scroll to the end, there is my beautiful treehouse. Okay, wow. It looks a lot better from the inside. I can't lie. But th this is not what this is about. Okay, wait. Here I am. I was just on the rock. And I was literally calling out to it. And there, right there. I took damage. I literally just watched myself take damage. Okay, I just paused it. I don't see anything or anyone anywhere. So maybe it's strong enough to bypass replay mod. Okay, but wait, I think I have an idea. Okay, please work, please work, please work. Oh, yes, we're in. And wait, my health is a lot lower than I thought it was. Okay, run, skidzy, run, skidzy, go, go, go. And if I just check my inventory, yes. Oh my gosh, guys, we got it. Okay, eat the kelp, eat the kelp, eat the kelp. Before we can open this, guys, we need to find the base. This is not safe right now. Last time I was logged in here, I was literally being attacked. Okay, here we go. Up the ladder, up the ladder, up the ladder. And just to be safe, boom. Okay. Woo. Okay, we made it. So now, if we just go up into the the safe house, I can explain what is going on. So let's just say Christmas came early this year, guys. We have the Skidzy Industries camera box brought to you by the Skidzy Industries Ghostbusters department. Yeah, that's right. We got one of those. Okay, no, but all jokes aside, I had my dev team whip up some tools to use against the Phantom clone. That's what I'm calling it. And yo, this looks sick. So the first item that we have is the Ghost Gazer 9000. That's right, boys. We got security cameras. Yo, it's even got the logo on the side. Yo, this is actually way too cool. Let's go ahead and load up two more on the other side. And then we got to be careful, but let's go down here. Ugh. One right there and boom, one right there. Okay, go, 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 go. Oh, okay, we made it back. But now we have the GG 9K tablet. And this thing looks actually insane. So I'm pretty sure if we just go ahead and right click it. Boom, guys, we are in the camera. And wait, what was that? 
flash. Okay, maybe I'm just over paranoid. But yeah, look at this, guys. We can literally look around. There's the other camera right there. And actually, if I just go ahead and exit out and then we go back in, oh, it's a scary clone. Nah, I'm just playing with you guys. It's me. Yo, look at me. Okay, but no, this is no time for jokes. We can switch between every single camera so that we could fully look around the map. And these cameras are specifically built to show entities that are invisible. So I actually think the cameras on the lower half of the tree are gonna be the best ones. And yeah, wait, what was that flash? Okay, other than some like weird flashing, I don't see anything out of the ordinary. Okay, I wish I could zoom in with the camera, but I... I can't tell what that is. There's something on the beach. Am I seeing things? Okay, let's switch to the other camera. Yeah, it's still there. And that flash just happened again. But wait, hold on. There's there's literally nothing there. I swear there was like something moving. I couldn't tell what it was. All right, guys, things are already kind of getting weird. I don't like this. But let's go ahead and check the other side of the tree house. Okay, I'm not seeing anything except for there's definitely something like in the tree. I can't tell what it is, but it's just there's something off. And the, the camera has flashed like three times in a row. I don't understand. Like it's actually act acting up. Oh my gosh, we found it. We actually found it. Okay, it's it's just standing there. It's not moving. It's literally just watching. Okay, I can't lie. I, I am very creeped out, but it's actually working. Okay, we actually did it. Oh my gosh, he's like glitching out like crazy, but he's literally there and he has my username. Okay, guys, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm not gonna exit the camera. I'm just gonna keep it right on him to see if he does anything. And I'm gonna close this Minecraft window. And while we check out the next seeds, we're just gonna let the footage run. So make sure to watch until the end of the video to see what happens. Now, the next seed is 990099. Again, Kind of an odd combination of numbers and we're gonna name this world darkness and you guys are about to see why in just a second and boom we're in ow ow what the um does something look a little weird about this to you guys hey get back get back we just generated this world how is it already nighttime so let's go ahead and swap into creative mode for this world because yeah this world is already acting a little bit funny that's a little odd but also it's literally the dead of night it's literally midnight the moon is right above me which actually makes sense because according to the lore c99099 apparently has a small chance of summoning an eclipse now i've been playing minecraft since 2012 and guys i have never seen an eclipse in this game but according to the lore it only happens on the seed and when it does really strange things begin to happen okay well well, first things first, let's go ahead and get into a bed and then we can change it to daytime. Wait, what? I literally, okay, let's go into bed again. All right, I'm sleeping, I'm sleeping and it's still night. Okay then. Okay, now I'm in survival mode. It probably wasn't working because I was in creative. I do kind of get that, but wait, yeah, it just did it again. It's still nighttime. What is going on? Okay, so I think that confirms it. The seed actually might be cursed, but how do we make an eclipse? Okay, wait, I think I have an idea. Maybe we need to try to glitch the seed kind of like we did with the last seed. So let's try throwing an ender pearl and then get in the bed. Yo, there's my ender pearl. I saw it land. And yeah, it's still nighttime. Okay, it did not work. Okay, wait, I'm actually just a bot. I can literally just type in slash time set day and boom. Okay, wait, I got the message in chat, but it's literally literally still midnight. All right. Yeah, this is really weird. But the only way to change the daylight cycle is in the bed. And look, I literally moved in the bed. But what if we try closing our game? Okay. I just closed it. I'm going to load back up and we'll see if it glitched it. Okay. Please tell me it did something. Yeah. It's literally... What the... Huh? What is go? What? There's an eclipse. Yo, we actually did it. This is actually a bug seed. Okay. I can't lie. This seed is pretty cool. But on to the next one the eclipse is actually cursed what is going on with the mobs wait if i look at my hand the mobs are like on top of it what is going on oh my gosh even the fishies and wait what the the doors the doors are literally opening on their oh, oh my gosh yo this guy's having the worst nap of his life yeah it's like all of the doors okay wait what happens if i just put down redstone what the, it's going on and off at the same time. Guys, the game is actually broken right now. It doesn't know what to do. Even the pistons, they're just going up and down. Okay, yeah, this is actually getting really creepy. Let's just try to set it back today. Oh, 
Oh my gosh. What is that in chat? Hello? It's actually just glitching. I can't even say... Okay, hold on. What if I try a sign? Hello? It... No way. Guys, the sign is also... Okay, okay. I'm actually so creeped out right now. Yeah, wait. All the mobs are like glitching together now. Dude, what is go... Okay. Okay, guys, I have to do it. I'm gonna go into survival mode. Hey, hey, Mr. Piggy. Guys, this is what it feels like to chew five gum. How much five gum did you eat? Okay, wait, he's actually chill. I was like half expecting him to just be like evil, but I think the game is just literally glitching. Like it doesn't know how to like process this eclipse. Ow. Wait, what? The pig has aggro on me. Okay, so wait, if I hit the mob, this sheep is hitting me too. Okay, wait, what about the fish? Oh my gosh, the fish is hitting me too. What is going on right now? <sighs> I logged out. Ooh. Okay, that was crazy. So this next seed only works on Minecraft version 1.20 pre-release snapshot one. And the seed for this world is 1.20 colon pre-release number one. So that's a seed name, but I already have it loaded up since one of you guys actually found out about this and sent it to me. And boom we're in. Now, allegedly, what makes this seed so scary is because it's actually by the Mojang employees themselves. Now, Minecraft does have pre-releases for every update that they do, and apparently sometimes they'll use certain seeds to test new parts of the update that they're thinking of adding. And so if we use the slash locate command, we need to find a biome called... Oh, yes, right there. Jagged Peaks. So if I just hit enter, it should give me the cords and boom. Okay, look at that, guys. We made it. So I know what you guys are thinking. Skidzy, why are you up in the mountains? What is going on? What are you looking for? Well, according to multiple users and the person that sent me this world, Mojang was testing out their newest feature, which was suspicious snow. Now, I have no idea what suspicious snow means. And I also don't know why it would be scary, but a lot of players have reported it is. And wait, there's something right here. Oh, wait, it's just a little igloo out in the middle of nowhere. Okay, that's awesome. It doesn't look like there's anything under the igloo. But as you guys can see, we're in spectator mode, so we can literally just see everything everywhere. Okay, wait, I see a villager outpost right here, but honestly, nothing out of the ordinary. I will say, though, I don't think I've ever seen this terrain. Like, this is actually crazy. Like, this does not look like vanilla Minecraft at all. But maybe we need to take, like, a closer look. Maybe I'm I'm flying too high up and I'm looking like too broadly. Okay, there is a cave right here, but I don't see anything. Hey, yo, is that just a regular snow block? Okay, let's go ahead and grab our handy dandy brush. And wait, yeah, what is this? Suspicious snow? We actually found it. Yo, this is actually real? Okay, I'm gonna go into survival mode and we're just gonna go ahead and use the brush on the snow. Yo, this is actually crazy. Oh, we got string. Okay, that's kind of random. I don't know what I was expecting to come out of suspicious snow. But wait, yeah, I think we just got more string. I do like how it just drops like a little like snow thing at the bottom after you brush it though. That That is a nice detail. And wait, this one, we just got three spider eyes. Okay, wait, I just got bone meal. Am I gonna get anything that's not creepy from the suspicious snow? I just got a skull. Yeah, okay. I, uh, I think I've, I think I've seen enough. What? What is that? What am I? Okay. All right, guys. It looks like behind all the suspicious snow, there's some sort of like cave or something. <laughs> hey, yo, what is this? And what are you? Okay, guys, there is a spider frozen in the ice. Wait, this is crazy. He's like sideways. Wait, can I, can I get him out? Oh my, okay. All right, he's alive. I'm sorry. I was trying to help you. Okay, he's he's not dying. All right, he finally died. Okay, guys, I was not expecting him to just pop out when I freed him like that. Oh my gosh, yo, there's another one right there. Yo, this entire cave is insane. Like I said, I don't think I've been in the Jagged Peaks biome, but this ice cave is like actually so cool looking. Like what's going on, little guy? What are you doing? Okay, we're definitely not gonna free another one because he's gonna kick my butt. I should kick your butt. Wait, what? What is this? Okay, I'm gonna hop back into creative because wait, I think we found something. Guys, this looks like, yeah, I knew it. This is a bone block. So is this supposed to be like a leg or something? And wait, there's one over here too. Wait, guys, what the heck is this? This looks crazy. This honestly looks like some sort of like rib cage, but it's like frozen in the middle of the ice. Okay, let's go ahead and try to dig this out. I'm gonna try my hardest not to break the integrity of the bone. Okay, I <laughs> just broke two 
blocks. And there we go. I think that's most of it out of the ice pillar. And yeah, I have no idea what this is. This looks insane. But there's more frozen spiders over here. Yo, what's going on, guys? Yo, high five. Oh, I literally just deleted him. <laughs> I'm so sorry you had to see that, but wait, hold on. There's more suspicious snow over here. Is this going to be different than the first suspicious snow? Okay, no, we literally just got a spider eye and we got more string. Okay, but I am going to check under it because it seems like whenever there's suspicious snow, you could find... Yes, I knew it. Oh my gosh. Okay, this looks crazy. So we're going from one cave to the next. Oh, yo. Oh, I... Woo. Okay, guys, I, 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 I don't, I don't like this. There are literally spiders everywhere right now. Oh my gosh. I feel like at any second, all of them are just going to come alive at once. It looks like there's like a ton of webs here. Is this supposed to be like their nest? Ugh. I don't even want to go near it. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I get I get aggressive when I'm scared, I guess. But okay, this looks like another nest or something. But wait, over here, there's like another bone leg thing. So I think that's the third one that we've seen. And there's another one right here. That's four. Oh my gosh, guys. There's so many just everywhere. Okay. Okay. Is there anything in the nest? Go, 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 go. Okay, I don't see anything. I'm getting out of there. But wait, hold on. Over here, there's like another structure. Okay, let's go ahead and break all the ice. And I'm also noticing that in this pre-release version, there's no water coming from the ice. That's super odd. I, I don't know if they made some changes or I have no idea. Okay, so I think I've freed most of this from the ice, except there's still some ice on the inside here, which actually kind of makes me think this thing is like hollow, like a skull or something. Yeah, like these are like the eyeballs. Balls. And then there's two fangs here. And then there's another eye hole on the side. Yeah, I can't lie, guys. This seems like just some sort of giant spider skull. Ooh, guys, I'm actually just getting the creeps looking at it. Like, this thing is huge. If this is a spider skull, look how big it is compared to this guy right here. And wait, hold on. If we check the back of its head, it has three bones and then one on top. Okay, wait, that actually makes me think gosh, how the heck do I get out of here? I'm actually panicking right now. Does the skull connect to this thing right here? Okay, not on this end because there's only one, but <gasps> I knew it. This end has three on the bottom and one on top. Okay, so if this is the body, it's not like a rib cage at all. Look, these are the, the little leg areas. Yeah, wait, if we count them, spiders have eight legs. So one, two, three, four, four on this side. And oh my gosh, guys, there's four on this side as well. Yo, okay, this is so sick. I actually hate spiders. So this is so cool, but so scary at the same time. Now, the next one is negative two, three, 96, 20. Now, it may seem like these are just random numbers, but they actually have a deep meaning because if you go to the chords negative two three nine six two zero or roughly about these chords the same as the c number it brings you here now i'm already here because this world was also sent to me by one of you guys just like the ice spider world but apparently this world has some sort of weird mine shaft roller coaster type thing i don't really know i mean as you can see something is already up we are in a badlands biome so it is kind of normal for mine shafts to kind of just be poking out like this yeah there's even like a minecart chest right here. But yeah, guys, I have no idea what's going on here. The, the rails are floating, okay? Like, I have never seen this before. What am I looking at? And I've also never seen rails all connected. Like, I feel like they're normally broken up. But either way, I'm gonna go ahead and grab a minecart. Oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh. Okay, so right off the rip, we already go under a spider spawner. Okay, and this guy... <laughs> What is he doing? It just goes like right under it and it keeps going. Okay. This looks pretty legit so far. But then we come into here and yeah, this looks pretty scenic. Except, oh my. Okay. Yeah, it literally just goes into a lava pit. Okay, let me just fly down here. Yeah, there's more flying rails. But then it looks like if you just drop down from right here, it looks like you land on this last block. I mean, maybe this is legit. It looks like the lava could have burnt like all the oak planks here. So that's why this big hole is here. I don't know, guys. I don't know. But okay, let's just keep going. And okay, it looks like we're picking up speed here. And oh my, oh my goodness. Okay, I was not expecting to make those turns. Yeah, there's more flying rails. Oh, and now we are in, we're in water. And okay, now we're falling. Okay, so I think we're supposed to just pick up right here. But this is 
actually pretty crazy. We're in an ancient city. Guys, I have never seen a mine shaft in an ancient city before. What the heck? Okay, so if I go into spectator mode, hold on. What am I going to see here? Oh my gosh. Okay, maybe the seed actually is legit because there's like naturally generated mine shafts literally everywhere guys i i don't think i've ever seen this many mine shafts in my life there they just don't stop but also there isn't like any speed boosters so wait it goes here and then it turns and then does it oh wait no it turns again i can't lie this isn't that scary like i it, it is weird that these exist wait does it just drop like right here <gasps> so you land in the soul fire all right i guess that is kind of scary because you died but wait oh my gosh guys this is an altar yeah you can even see the candles and the skull okay yeah this is actually terrifying you literally get sacrificed if you ride this roller coaster okay guys here we go moment of truth boom he's gone He's actually gone. I left the camera running on him. I didn't move at all. He's he's literally gone. Okay, let's switch to the other cameras. I don't see anything. Guys, I'm actually so scared. I don't want to leave the cameras. What if he's literally behind me in game? I am so scared right now, guys. Oh my gosh, he's nowhere. He's gone. He's actually gone. There he is. I got him. He moved. He's closer now. I didn't move at all, and he just came closer to me. Oh my gosh, wait, there's a cat walking in front of it. Oh, what is it doing? That happened right here. He's right there. I'm going down. I'm pulling out the shovel. That literally happened right here. Did I imagine that? The cat is literally gone. What was that? Okay, I think I'm actually just paranoid. I thought I saw something. Okay, let's check the tablet. Okay, there's me, and he's actually gone again. Okay, wait, so if I walk over here here should be lined up with that camera and wait yeah that's me looking at the camera he's right in front of me exit exit why can't i exit the camera what's going on wait yo what's going on what's going on connection lost what just happened 